Hi everybody, I'm Kimberly Edwards from cookingwithkimberly.com and this is what I say about food. And this is what I say about Kampot pepper. That's Kampot, K-A-M-P-O-T. This is what it looks like, Kampot pepper. And that's from, it's a special pepper from Cambodia. Now where they grow these peppercorns, hi mom. Hi baby. Happy Mother's Day. Oh, thank you. This is my mom, Ingrid Turner. Check her out, ingridturnertoday.com. So, um... We're just talking about the Kampot pepper that I got mm -hmm. from Kampot-pepper.asia. I got them online. I didn't get them at my grocery store. They're a rare, more rare pepper to find, so you have to look for them online. Mm -hmm. Now, I got three different varieties from them. One is black, one is red, and one is white, okay? They're from the same plant. It grows the same way all as well. They're just harvested at different times and treated in a different way. Now, the black ones, they go the longest on the plant. They're sun-dried. They're the spiciest, the most intense yes okay the red ones they're a little bit less intense a little bit more nutty they have a beautiful um color to them and they're great for meats as just as well the red meats but a little bit lighter more mild flavor so like yes. your lamb that i made you tonight oh and it was fabulous with the red pepper on. Yep, oh, and i used these and i a nice flavor broke them up in my mortar and pestle and i went all over them delicious and then the white ones it's more of a I for lack of a better term a pepper whisper it's not that soft but it's much less intense than Maybe these something you'd want to use when you're making a dip or mm -hmm. or um, something uh, a little pate or something that you don't want overpowering or pepper. anything light in color so that it just blends yes. in Yes. The thing I was super impressed with with these particular peppercorns from this um, site that I got them from is that the peppercorns are so big and plump. Big, whole giant know, peppercorns. They're gorgeous. And they're so uniform in size. I was shocked because sometimes you get peppercorns mm -hmm. in bottles and some are like this big and some are great big honking These ones. are like little currants almost. They're, they're perfect. Really, and it's and like, they're so perfect. It's like somebody actually went through and sorted them. Yeah. <laughs> they're super good. Anyway. I hope you guys try these out, check them out. Not all pepper is created alike. There's all different kinds of pepper out there. If you didn't check them out, make sure you check them out on my site. I have all kinds of cool things on there that you might not have known about. Peppercorns can really give you a super um, change in pepper flavor, mm -hmm. right? Not just that same old, you know, shaker pepper that you've used your whole life. Mm -hmm. Try some different stuff out. You'll be surprised at how different they really are. Right. Pepper isn't just pepper. No. Nope. I mean, each one has its own attributes and oh my. Absolutely. It does wonderful things for your food. These are very floral. They're very mm -hmm. spicy. They're fragrant. They're aromatic. So fresh. Lovely. Anyway, I hope you check them out. Campot-pepper.asia. And check out my mom, IngridTurnerToday.com. I hope you like the fan page. It's Facebook.com slash Cooking with Kimberly. Follow me on Twitter at Cooking with Kim E with a capital E. My shows are on YouTube.com slash Cooking with Kimberly and iFood.tv slash Cooking with Kimberly. And my site is Cooking with Kimberly.com. Come interact with me. Let me know what's going down in your culinary world. All right, everybody? Be champions in your kitchen. And eat bye deliciously. Bye. bye. <laughs>